You're the central cheerleader. You're the uh, you're the speaker in residence for Austin tech startups. And my main question, my main question, is how can Austin become the next Silicon Valley? How is is that possible? Right. So I think that's been like uh, my theme for about the last 10, 15 years, which is we don't want to be the next Silicon Valley. Okay. Um, right, everybody. We don't want to be in Silicon Valley. Yeah. So um, I, I went to Stanford as an undergrad and I studied the history of Silicon Valley and part of what you learn is that Silicon Valley is really the product of the gold rush. The 49er was uh, 1849. People went to Silicon Valley to make their fortune. They came with nothing and then all of a sudden if they struck gold, they'd be a millionaire, right? And that culture is part of what, like basically that was the formation of California and that culture permeates both Northern California as well as Southern California in terms of an overnight success. You're, you come as nothing, and all of a sudden you're somebody. And so that's part of their DNA. And everything they do, they used to use technology because that's the biggest lever that you can get to create a huge amount of something. Whereas Austin has a completely different thing. People come to Austin to be ourselves, right? Be themselves. Um, and we are all on this journey of figuring out yourself from your thoughts, from your general. I guess, I guess I'm a, <laughs> an example of that. And so that's part of where our, our startup culture derives from a personal journey where people are discovering what their passions and talents are, and they don't necessarily care whether it's gonna be big or small. That's not the kind of core outcome that they're looking for. They're looking for something that is authentic, that expresses their personal journey, and that they can give to the world. So how is that expressed in, how is that expressed in the uh, environment here? What are you guys doing that Silicon Valley isn't doing? As I, as I understand it, you're saying that other places are doing, are making tools, and you guys use the tools, how does that work? Yeah, so, you know, I, I think about the relationship between, for example, South By, you just mentioned how you hate yourself at South By. Um, but if you look at what, what Silicon Valley does really well is they make these scalable tools. Whereas Austin, we're all of us in Austin are, are constantly bombarded with culture, there's all kinds of new culture going on.